Local 24 News, meteorologist Chelsea Chandler. With the Mid-South Certified Most Accurate Forecast. All right, well, it's nice and quiet for us right now. Not seeing any kind of rain on the radar, not expecting to. It should be very dry, at least for the last day for a while. We do have rain for the foreseeable future after we get past this holiday. But we've been so blessed. Think of the weekend that we've had. It's the end of May, the unofficial start to summer, and it was feeling more like fall yesterday and the day before. So definitely uh, don't have any complaints. It is a little cool in some areas this morning. 49 in Jonesboro, right at 50 in Jackson, Somerville, Corinth, Oxford. 51 in Holly Springs and Dyersburg, 56 in Memphis, 57 in Clarksdale. So anywhere from the upper 40s to the mid and upper 50s. So a little bit of a gamut there, but we are definitely going to be all seeing our temperatures climbing once the sun really gets up and gets a chance to get going. 55 degrees at 9 a.m. We'll see plenty of sunshine as we head towards lunch around 75, 77 degrees. So fire up that grill. It's going to be a great afternoon for you as we head into the afternoon. Sunshine with a few clouds here and there and we head into the low 80s. Even as we head towards the evening, we're still in the upper 70s. It won't be until after sunset that we even get close to the 60s. So again, it's going to be a great day and our humidity is still really low. We're in the low 50s for our dew points today, which means the air is going to be very comfortable. It's not going to be full of a lot of moisture. We are going to see that changing as the week goes on, but that's because it's going to be raining. So of course we're going to see more moisture in the area and in the air. So Wednesday, the greatest chance for rain, the highest dew point that we see through the work week. So we'll keep an eye on that. Of course, pool forecast. Well, hopefully you have a pool. If you don't, if you're going to be doing something else today, whether that's just enjoying sitting outside, going and honoring uh, our veterans, whatever it may be, the most important part of this is that UV level. It's in an eight, so it's considered high. I just want to make sure you're putting your sunscreen on, reapplying it throughout the day, just because you can burn very quickly when we have UV like this. And our skin, if you haven't been out a lot lately, probably still adjusting to it. No one wants to deal with the sunburn. No one wants to deal with skin cancer down the road. So uh, just make sure you're taking care of yourself. Now, looking at your hour by hour, it's relatively uneventful today. You're just going to see to sunshine. You've got a slight breeze coming in from the south southeast at about five miles an hour. But as we head into the evening, clouds begin begin to build ahead of what will be a rainier afternoon. It's going to be spotty showers, though, as you see a scattered rain and some possible thunder showers as we head towards the evening with our greatest risk for rain coming in on Wednesday. So looking at your seven day forecast again today, beautiful tomorrow. We have a 30% chance in the afternoon about one o'clock that begins and that up to 80% by the evening. Then we have a 90% chance Wednesday and you can see that continues with about 30 to 40% chance through Sunday. And again, those aren't terrible. We're not expecting any washouts, just chances for rain. And as we get closer to each day, we'll be able to give a better idea of what exactly is going on. As of right now, not too concerned with severe weather, but we will be keeping an eye on it just in case. Now, as far as what's